Today we are going to do something a little bit different. We are going to do a 24 hour kind of skim along the top edge of Wales. So throughout all the little seaside villages and places like that, we're going to go and see if we can find a pier or a hill or a <laughs> fun fair. Or... I don't know what we're definitely going to find. What? Some sea. We're going to see <laughs> the sea. We're also going to head out and go to see some of the coastal fun fairs along the way. Our first stop is going to be Prestats, Prestats, Prestatin. <laughs> Prestatin. Prestatin. I think that's how you pronounce it. However, uh, that's how it's spelled. Prestatin. Please get it all those Prestats <laughs> out. <No. laughs> I don't think I've ever been to Prestatin. No, I haven't. No. Yeah, no. It's all like, along the border. It's like near Rail and all that sort of place, but it's never really yeah. there. Yeah. So first stop is going to be there. We don't know what's there. So you're going to learn about Prestatin as much as we are. have a camper van if you get distracted easily. We just drove past this sign here and it says Waterfall Road. Uh, right there, this earth, this, this earth waterfall. I'm not going to pretend to try and announce it. Uh, pronounce, <laughs> announce it. Pronounce it. Uh, this is uh, part of the waterfall. We're at the bottom of the waterfall. So we're going to walk up. Next door to the entrance is the tea room and it's like the ice cream and stuff. And this is where you pay to get up. So, one pound, two pound. Make sure you pay. Keeps the upkeep of this area. Oh my gosh, there's a cave. <gasps> Are you supposed to get here? <gasps> Don't go in here. It's really wet. <laughs> right, if you come here, get yeah. yourself some wellies. Yeah, get some wellies. Now we're looking here. Can you see it? Hang on, I'm just going to turn the camera off and turn the brightness up. Yeah, you can see it a little bit better now. It's like a cave. It's quite. It's got a fair bit of water and not really wearing appropriate shoes. But I would love to walk in there if I had better shoes with me. Awesome. How good is that? Yeah, it's a bit wet around here, camera's getting so... Top of it, you can't see it. <laughs> no, it's over there. So I think if you walk a little bit further up there, maybe you'll be able to see it from a bit further up there. A leech. <laughs> not a leech. It's, I think I it is. You might have a little mouth. <laughs> it's slug mouth. Can you see the sea? No, no. Yeah. It's yeah. Where? Oh, I don't know if you can see that over there. I feel like I need to film because I just fell over, Victor fell over, and Daddy's just fell over. Oh! <laughs> it's like a fun house around here. Apart the note, there's no fun to be had. Just adventure! Which one is it? I don't remember. So you could have been really fun and just not told me. <laughs> I'm so scared. Yeah, it's is it going to going inwards? Am I going inwards? Get a bit of a bend. Go on, Victor. Oh, you're so teeny. It doesn't move for you, little tiny twinkle toes.
Anyway, just walking through here and look we found a little cave. And obviously us being the way we are, I'm, I'm well going in. God, this is a bit of a mission, especially when you're on the brass. Oh my good gosh. Wait a minute, stay there. Not safe for you, Ketten. Let me go. Shoo! He fell there. Oh my gosh. Ah! Wait a minute, let me get me brolly down. I'm going to get that in, am I? Oh, wait. Guys. Mommy, don't go too far. I'm not going too far. Look at the other end. Wow. Like there's a bit of a drop, but how cute is that? Okay. I'm going to do a yummy. It's not a cave, it's just a little walkway. Oh, it's so cool. Still. It's so oh, cool. Is I know, right? And there's look, and oh, the some coffee cups. <laughs> oh. Oh gosh, I'm too big for this. Why were people teeny back in the day? Oh, oh that's mega cute, that is. Y'all kind of come out. Oh, I feel like I've done a workout. <laughs> come on, chickens. Oh no, man, it's so tight, isn't it? How tiny were people? So tiny. Bing, come on, sorry. come down to the bottom of this thing with the massive rock and yeah obviously they had to be in the cave didn't they oh, I can't out myself can I hello oh it does isn't it yeah. Back in the van, let's go. We're back in the van and we're all wet and damp and smelling like well garlic because I might <laughs> have got some. <laughs> we so we are gonna head over to where we were gonna go without like, getting distracted. Yeah, by we're waterfalls. Not... <laughs> and we found more than we thought we were gonna. We thought it was a bloody waterfall and there was caves. Yeah, and a river. that was oh. the best 50p ever. Yeah, definitely worth stop it. off if you're definitely heading up to Prestatin or something. Well worth a visit, especially for 50p. A little walk in the summer, that would be amazing. All right, let's go to Prestatin. Just a quick one. All right, obviously we haven't had Doug for that long, but does anybody know about the camper van wave? Well, it's not even necessary as anything. No, does anyone do campervan waves? Some people do it. You do it a lot. I wave and it. I've had quite a few people do it to us. Yeah. I'm just wondering how far and wide that spreads. Well, the thing is, some people it. like to do it, and then you do it to some people, and they look at you like you're absolutely it's batshit. It's usually people with bigger, fancier campers that want to do it. We've got an old boy like Doug. You'll always get a wave. Yeah. Woo. And we like to call this. So we've got we've got Doug the Transit. See an old transit, they'll always wait. Not just general transit, shopping campers. <laughs> but if we just see all the, um, all the vans, work yeah, like the old VW uh, campers as well. I'm not talking like the old like split screen ones or anything like that. But like uh, all the T4s with high tops and stuff like that. Yeah, we like to call them dubs. Yeah, because they they look they look <laughs> like Doug, but they're not. <laughs> <laughs> I saw a face hugger. Did you? Yeah, in the window. Oh my gosh. Right, we're gonna have to park up somewhere. Basically, I don't like know where. Shop, like Let's go in the weird shop. It looks closed from outside. But it's got open on the window, so let's go in. Right, we just went in the garden den. Uh, couldn't, we didn't film in there. It was quite small, a little bit quiet. 
We had a chat to the guy, I know he's a lovely guy, but I couldn't film too much because it was quite brutal in there, some of the stuff yeah, in there. Like not body parts and not, not, not massively kid friendly, but the boys were okay with it. But it's got, um, yeah, it had like uh, um, weapons and body parts and stuff. But we're heading back to the van now. We'll carry on our trip. We're actually nearly at our first stop. We've managed to stop already. So let's go and get in Dougie Doug. We are. Welcome to Prostatin. Um, it's got a height barrier on it. Go keep going round. There might be more around that way. No, we don't get a fit, shall we, Joe? Right, that Prostatin does not accommodate four vehicles that are a bit big. Is he laughing at me? I don't know how I feel about it. Like some bits look alright, but then some bits look a bit ratty, don't they? Yeah. Right, that one's a 2.3 height limit. Um, but it doesn't seem that they want to accommodate for any motorhomes or campers here because it's bloody hard, isn't it? Do you reckon? We might have to do a side of the road one. Who did we get at all, man? We did stand up in it. We, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we have been driving around for quite a bit and we've got no luck, have we, Joe? I don't know anywhere to park. No. They have uh, limits on parking on the side of the road one because they've got single lines. Oh, is it? And they've got dates from the oh. 1st of April to the 3rd of September. You're not allowed to park between 8 and 8. Right, okay, so I think we might have to move on to our next. Uh... Press that in. If you've got a tall van. It's good for a little one. If you've got like a transporter or something like that, oh, you yeah. might be all right. But yeah. if you've got a tall van or a motorhome or a caravan, I, I wouldn't recommend coming unless you're asking to stay in a pontons yeah, or something. Because yeah, yeah, there's a pontons around the corner. Yeah, it's not. It doesn't seem very friendly for for us camper vanners, does it? Yeah. So I wanted to have a little look around the town as well. I don't know yeah, if this is the off. thing. Like most little seaside places it's quiet around here at the moment and we would have given them a little bit extra money gone for a coffee or got a sandwich or something but oh well i guess it's on to real i edit um if we survive going to real it's a bit nicer now isn't it? i think apparently it's supposed to be nicer so we'll let you know if it is any nicer or whether or not We're in real. Managed to find a park up on the side of the road. Not park up, as in like staying park up. It's just one of these sort of side of road ones. Found, found a parking space. Um, yeah, we're just gonna have a little grown real. Look, there's a bloody dragon there. We, oh my god. I mean, we we have a sort of rough idea what real's like, and generally, it looks cleaner than I remember it being. Yeah, it's not got good like reputation, has it? But it looks quite nice. So we're gonna have a little grown. There's a little fair as well, so we might get on a ride or two. <laughs> So that there. Not a drop tower. There's not a drop one. tower. Looks like apocalypse, doesn't it? But it actually used to be an observation tower that used to go up really, really dead slow and spin, and you couldn't see out of it because it was either dead misty outside or there was too many dirty handprints all over it. <laughs> this is what it's all about for me when it comes to um, yeah, that's what I love about seaside towns is all the, the actual little town shops and stuff. You just get so much weird stuff. It's all just odd things everywhere. Look. That's, that's, that's like Queen's that. Shopping Centre. Yeah, let's go in there. Yeah. <laughs> that's I just managed to film them, was it? It wasn't, it wasn't a shopping centre in, in any form of the world. Let's have a look down here and see what weird stuff we can find. I know, I know, weather spoons, but we are in real and there was nowhere else to eat. And it was warm, yeah. and there was so you know, we've been Yeah, so we're, we're in, we've come over to the fair and, I mean, there's not a lot going on because the weather's awful. I don't know if we're going to be able to go on these coasters. I know they're not great, but got to get them coaster canes. That one's definitely closed, it's got a fence all around it. Oh, they're all fenced off. Just realised it's all fenced off, look. No. I mean, it doesn't surprise me because the weather's absolutely shocking. Got the simulator over there. It's the big one. What? Why do you want to go on it? I hate 
I'm getting about that, not gonna lie. Actually, that's quite fun. We've been on a case exactly like that, I'm not sure which one, but. Yeah, unfortunately, it's all closed. All right, we've gone on a simulator. It was the only thing we could go on. It's the only thing open. It was only three quid each. It's going so bad. It's yeah, retro. it's terrible. Where's going on? The big one at Blackpool. Yeah, it's the big one in Blackpool. I'm very excited. It's the old train. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Jesus, this is about rattling. <laughs> oh my god! This is worse. Pretty sure the big one's smoother than this. Oh my god! <laughs> it doesn't even feel like it's going in time with the actual ride. Oh my god! Oh god! Are we getting kicked in the back? <laughs> this is absolutely hilarious. Who did it again? <laughs> oh my good god. This is ridiculous. This is genuinely worse than going to the natural person. Oh my god. Can you even fall out of the chair? <laughs> You might not have seen a hell of a lot of footage in there because it was we were getting thrown up to pieces. But that was absolutely <laughs> ridiculous, wasn't it? I fell! I fell on the kid! <laughs> no, this is what happened. Let's go back in time. We were like, what? And I was like, ah! <laughs> that was honestly, that was ridiculous. It was amazing. You know, that was like the best. The big one's quite ever. the big one's fairly smooth from what I can remember, but that was ridiculous. <laughs> anyway, we're gonna go and try and set foot on the beach briefly and then move on to the next town because we're heading back down towards Dougie Doug. Right, we've found the entrance to the beach. Well, an entrance. There's some, uh, there's some uh, groundworks going on here, which I reckon is probably for like a hotel or something. Um, we found the beach. What a lovely day for the beach. <laughs> it's, not, it's not raining. Yeah. It's the beach, there's no one. Go on the beach. Right, let's, there's no one on the beach, let's go. That sounds like my kind of place. Alright, we're on the beach. Welcome to Will. Wh Wh <laughs> Welcome to Rill Beach. <laughs> you know what, you and your kid are going to be loads of shit. Yeah. Because you get Victor's collecting them. <laughs> that looks like, I don't know, it's all flooded. Look at this, what on earth? <laughs> oh man, look at it. I think it's 
think it's called Funland, by the way. All right, let's go and in go to Funland. Let's go. Look at that, magic mouse. Right, we've got to find out if the boys can go on it. Let's go and check your heights, boys. Boys can go on it, can't you? On the magic mouse, so we've got to go and get some tickets. Four credit seats, so I'm not, well, don't, you have to get it in certain packages. And the magic mouse! Yeah. This is a spinning coaster. I'm not sure what they're normally called, but basically just a standard not spinning coaster. Not what do you mean? Not oh no, yeah, we're on our own because we're spinning. Not on this one. Go down a couple of levels oh. first. <laughs> Get ready, Get ready, Dolly, I'll drop. Hands up in the air, just think. Why are we spinning? Get ready. The most spinniest of magic mouse, well, mouse rides I think I've ever been on. Are we going to go on um, the uh, the haunted house? Yes. What is the artwork in here? It's actually really good. Here we go. The Monster Express. Oh. Here we come. Literally, we're just using the rest of our credits. We had to get a couple more just to get on this, but got a coaster credit. <laughs> Two coaster credits. Oh, it's the balance, I presume. Oh, oh well, oh well, oh well. Right. So we realised that there is definitely a reason why we don't sit at the front. It's so slow. Oh, Watch so this. So slow. Watch this. Does it? Does it really? Distance? Look, look how slow we go over. And then because of the weight at the back of the train, it just pushes you into the corner like this. <laughs> right, we have just pulled over and had a lovely cup of tea and a little piece of cake by Con Colwyn, Colwyn Bay. Col Colwyn? Colwyn? Colwyn Bay. Colwyn Bay. I'm going to show you what it looks like if you've never been to Colwyn Bay. Um, it looks quite pretty, a little like this. Right, we're off now because we have found a place on park for a night uh, where we can do a little bit of wild camping. It looks proper cute. Uh, it's not by the sea unfortunately because there's loads of parking restrictions around here but um, we'll show you what it looks like if we can park there. <laughs> it just arrived and it looks so pretty. It actually looks really good. Um, there's, there's one of the van, no, there's two. There's one proper, well, there's one camper over there and there's one little uh, pickup convertible over there. Convert, like, it's there. It looks so good. Fancy having a look around. So our gorgeous little doggy dog is there. And look, we've got a little... A lake. lake. It's a lake, yeah. I lake? guess it's kind of a lake. Water thing. And there's a little park here, so we're gonna go. The boys are gonna have a little run around in the park. <laughs> oh, it's so pretty around here. Do you know what? You'd actually, I think.
think you would pay good money to stay here. Yeah. And it's free. It's pretty good, doesn't it? Yeah. It's going here. Someone, someone new parking next to us. Yeah, there's another van that's just pulled up. Better Big. not be noisy snorers. <laughs> Yeah, he's gonna run now because there's a dog coming. We've been back to the van, <clears throat> had a lot of sit down, worked out what we're going to do, and we're going to just walk down into the town of Colwyn Bay. It is Colwyn Bay, isn't it? I think. And we're just walking, and we just we took a chance and walked through some bushes, and then we just found this little walk that's like along this stream with like waterfalls and stuff. It's lovely. So we're going, yeah, we're going to walk along here and see what we find. What's up guys? We're back at the van. Um, yeah. We had a big dinner. Um, wait, rewind. We went walking through town. We couldn't find anywhere that we could really eat comfortably because they were all quite pubby. So we didn't really want to take the kids in because no, it's late. It was there was like groups of people in there and stuff. So. Local, wasn't it? And you know, as much as it is lovely, we are not from here. And yeah. You know, and you don't feel that awkward. And looking the way that we look, sometimes it's easier just to come back and have a... Uh, so, because we had a big dinner earlier, we're soup. still pretty full. <laughs> Yeah. This is absolutely stuffed from where we went to Weatherspoons and we had a big curry and the boys had like sausages and chicken nuggets and stuff so yeah we thought we'd just come back. A bit of bread and butter, some cup of soups. Boys, what are you doing in the back? Boys? Do you want to have a look? <laughs> you won't be able to see very well but <laughs> they're in there. You can't see them. What are you doing boys? Just watching. Watching a film. You got a little cinema room in the back covered up. Episodes. Yeah, watching something. Um, so yeah, we're just waiting for a couple of weeks to cool down. We're gonna eat these. We're gonna play a little game or something. Yeah, we always and do then, a little family game. And then we're um, probably gonna snuggle up and get ready for bed. We've realised that we are now surrounded. Oh, by there is vans. six vans here now. So yeah. strength in numbers tonight for sure. Do you know what we felt a bit awkward at first, but now we are we are solid that we are no. not going to get moved on or anything. So <clears throat> we'll see you tomorrow. Yeah, we'll see you in the morning. Good morning. Good morning. Uh, it's On a really very bright. bright and sunny day. Oh my god, the Clyde's just gone in, what the heck? Thank, Are you? Thanks, <laughs> thanks Clyde's. <laughs> yeah, we've just got up. If you look in the distance, you'll see where Doug is. Can you see him? Can you yeah, see him? Head, and then there do somewhere. a turn and you can oh, see what we park next to. This is where we stayed yeah, last night. Victor's yeah. sitting on the bird poo. See it on Don't it. sit on it. <laughs> I'm not trying to. So yeah, we've um, just woke up, we are, I don't know what this, I think it's called The Dingle. The Dingle? Yeah, I think it's called The Dingle or something like that, this area is. Um, There's already somewhere called The Dingle. Yeah, in Shrewsbury. Dun, 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 the anyway, up, we're up, we're going to have our coffee. Dun. Sitting by the watery thing. Taking the kind of views, and then we're going to get moving. So we'll see you on the road. Thinking this was London though, and it, um, 
Well, I was looking for the pier and there's no pier and we've realised that well, we are not a in bit London. Along, Can you drive all the way along the coast? You will try. <laughs> right, we are at Rose on Sea <laughs> thanks to trusty Google Maps. Not London though, so. Not, not yet. Anyway, this looks absolutely beautiful down here, like a little marina type bit with boats. some boats. Yeah, apart from, ignore the roadway. <laughs> Once it's all done, it'll be beautiful. Um, and then there's like some food places and some little shops and little seaside thing. Oh, it's really cute around here actually. We can find here, something. For, yeah, park and have a little walk for five. Yeah, Look at all them boats. Right, I'm super bright apparently. Oh my God, guys, uh, but yeah, the sun is, is still really shining. Beautiful. We're on the beach in Ross on Sea. I think it's Ross on Sea. Yeah. Um, thought we'd stop and have a little look around because this this beach looks ace. It smells like dog weight, It does smell a bit like dog way. But it's just quite nice the little marina area in there. Um, we came from all the way over there yesterday and we travelled all the way along the coast. All the way along here. It's been a good time, and we still haven't finished yet. We've got one last place to go. Yeah. So yeah, we're going to hang out here for a little bit, and then go and have a little look through the town. If we see anything interesting, so will you. <laughs> Me and Vincent are walking along the jetty. I think these are called jetties, dude. Oh, it's getting sloppy down here. Yeah. And it goes right above the water. Vincent doesn't want to go. Do you want to go back? Are you, you going to come with me? I'll go a little bit far. I'm <laughs> going to. I'm actually. I'm going all the way along. feel massively safe these move a tiny bit. Vincent's standing back there. <laughs> I'm, gonna go, I'm not going to go all the way to the end though because the water is coming up over it every now and then with the waves. Small waves are bringing it up. <laughs> He's coming there. <laughs> Go on then. T Rex. Go on. <laughs> That's more of like a uh, what are they called? Velociraptor. <laughs> That's the one. We're back at the van. We had some breakfast, well, brunch. Um, in a very odd little restaurant, actually, that there was too many. There was more people working in there than there was actually eating at one there point. There was actually like there was 11, 11 staff people working in there, in and they all just kept coming up to you like, and you're like, you like, yeah, they all took an order from someone twice. <laughs> um, so yeah, we're scrapping uh, off London though. We're not going to go to London though because we actually went there not too long ago. So we're going to finish off with the next location, which you will see. In nice. a second. <laughs> Can we just do right, we're here. This yeah. place yeah. is incredible. Uh -huh. Can we do a rotation? This is the little orm. Near London, no. Alright. Here's our beach reveal. There's a lot of people standing at the top, weirdly, like there's something going on down there. Maybe, yeah. There's some crazy amount of birds around here. Some very strange looking birds. I'm trying to work out what they are. Pop off this trip. There's seals on the beach. Look at that. They're all just lying across the edge of the beach. So there you go, look. Why? How incredible.
Yeah, we were not expecting to see this today. I've never seen so cute in the world. It's amazing. We were expecting to go down to the beach, but there's a sign over there that says molting seals it's between it January and April. So we're actually, we caught the very end of it. It's, it's called, people can start going down there at May, but I'm not sure how you get down there. It's scramble. Yeah, there we go, we'll see. Yeah, they're down there Absolutely incredible. Top of the rocks up here, and it is pretty high. Not as high as that. Everyone's panicking there. I'm standing on top of the rock. It's not actually windy at all, it's actually really nice and calm. And we're gonna go back down. Yeah. My bum. <laughs> Wait, is that, is that bum? I can't believe we saw sea lions. No. Seals. Like, what? Seals. Is it seals? Seals of Bay, Angel Bay. Angle Bay. If you want some information on the little seals, there you go. In Welsh and in English. Lovely. So, it caters for everyone. Hello. Wait, cut. What is it? You got a broom? Stick. Flying it like a witch. Yeah. What? Witch? Oh my goodness me. Giants. <laughs> oh, you fell over then. I just realised that um, we've stood on top of here. And the, if you can see that in the faint distance over there, that's where we started. That is where we started yesterday. <laughs> and this is the end of our journey. It's been a beautiful 24 hours, hasn't it? Yeah, it has. Really nice. Mm. Nice and relaxing. Um, and a bit hectic trying to get everything done because apparently we can't stop can't somewhere. Stop. Well, especially when you see some sights. Yeah, that's it. So, um, hope you've enjoyed this one. Yeah, if, you, um, if you've enjoyed it and you want to see more of the. Uh, the Welsh coast. Let us know. Drop a comment below and tell us if you want to if you want us to do another 24 hours and continue from land Dudno basically and sort of down. Or you can go all the way around. Um, what's that place called? Oh God. Anglesey. Anglesey. Yeah, yeah we'll do. We could do. We do it. We really want to go back to Anglesey to be honest. So yeah, let us know. Um, but yeah, if you've enjoyed this, give us a like, give us a subscribe, and make sure you return for more. Keep smiling, stay positive, and have a great week. <laughs> See you in the next one. Where's he got Goodbye. <laughs> hey, get me in. <laughs> Damn, this hill is so steep. <laughs>